Good evening. Today, the woman who drove drunk with her child in the back seat and killed two people were, who were changing a tire on the side of I-25 pleaded guilty. At today's hearing, Christy Noriega explained what led up to that deadly crash. News 13's Jackie Kent is live at Sandoval County District Court with the very latest. Jackie. Dean, Christy Noriega told the judge today in court she was nervous and was crying as she struck a plea deal. Then she was let out of the courtroom and off to jail. Today, the families of Noriega and the victims looked on as Noriega, Noriega pleaded guilty to two counts of vehicular homicide and one count of aggravated DWI. Judge Lewis McDonald said the maximum sentence she could face is 30 years. Her blood test results showed her BAC was at a 0.14, nearly twice the legal limit. While she admitted to driving drunk, she didn't take full responsibility for killing two innocent people. My intention was to go have lunch with my cousin. I did have a drink there and I was driving. I lost control of my vehicle due to another vehicle tailgating me. It was on March 6th when Mickey Shamblin and Lonnie Escovito were changing a tire on the side of I-25 north of Bernalillo. Noriega was drunk behind the wheel with her two-year-old in the car when she plowed into the two men, killing them. She caused even more controversy a couple months later when she started a GoFundMe account to help her pay for a defense attorney. Now the DA's office says the plea deal did not come with an agreement for a shorter sentence. Noriega faces up to 30 years behind bars. Dean, back to you. All right, Jackie, thank you. She will stay in custody until her sentencing date. That date has not yet been set.